help to reduce your cost. So we're talking about AI. I think AI is big in the energy industry and the oil and gas industry generally. We're talking about AI helping to optimize operations. I think I read case studies where AI has actually helped to reduce the cost of operations for the typical oil and gas industry. And I, I, I know that particular study was rather revealing because when the AI was running the plant, that plant was actually, gener was actually consuming less energy. So AI can actually help LNG companies and oil and gas companies you know, have greener operations. And AI can also help your, cost your customer care, can help to coordinate your, your vessels. And I think, I'm not certain, but I think Asad Gas actually has employed some level of AI to coordinate their over 70 ships. So it makes it easy for them to do their ship to ship transfer, you know, translocation of ships. Yeah, Qatar gas ships can actually deliver products to two countries at the same time. The QMAX is huge at 265,000 cubic meters of gas in one QMAX vessel. So the QMAX can arguably deliver, you know, an LNG vessel to an LNG terminal in London, you know, and deliver another part of that. LNG cargo to another country. I'm not aware of any other LNG seller that can do that. So I think that that's commendable. So visualizations in LNG operations, that's something that's also huge. It's going to help with skill development, scenario analysis, HSC trainings. So you know, you just use that, those visual, like Oculus headpiece and all the other headpieces that you have to show your staff what the possibilities are, whether you're trying to train, for a certain level of skill development. Maybe you need to change a turbine in your plant and you're trying to plan it. And you know that if you want to bring out the entire turbine, it's pretty sizable. So you need to be sure that you're getting the right size of the crane. The crane can carry the turbine. Everybody involved in it knows how to do the operation safely. Visualization is going to be huge. Machine learning is also, it's like, as, as a part of AI, that's something that's going to be huge. So when you have your plant, your turbines being able to learn and observe how they're doing their operations. It's something that, that's gonna help you to you know, increase your efficiency, reduce your cost of operations, and make you make your, that's your plant a, a bit greener. Because machine learning coupled with Internet of Things, that gives you that smart plant that helps you to reduce your cost and increase your profitability. So Internet of Things is when your plants, you know, your plant is, is connected in real time by internet when the machines are talking to each other. So imagine maybe a turbine is operating below capacity. So rather than having your workmen inspect it, although they will still inspect it, your turbine is able to tell the control tower, whoever is in the monitoring, monitoring it digitally that, hey, I'm having issues, I'm overheating, or I don't like the gas I'm being fed with, or I'm not just giving my full output. You need to change some parts. And if after changing the parts, the turbine can tell you, I'm sorry, I think I'm, I'm reaching my shelf life, and you're going to need to replace me. So wireless solutions are also critical. So imagine you have your, your plants, you have your vessels, you have your truck, truck loading plants, 